be the yeah we would be in such trouble i have to say if uh the word yeah ever disappeared um from the english language i'm just saying if, if that ever vanished if we ever lost the word yeah we would be in some serious trouble hello peoples what's up everybody hi uh, lego what's up memo hello roix hello glob hey salonis what's up durbin what do you need to do about changing your shipping address for Kickstarter? Uh, if you need to change that, you should be able to contact um, the people at Silence in the Library. There should be a um, contact link for uh, backers, and um, you should be able to get a hold of um, Ron Garner, who's the head of Silence in the Library, and he'll be the one to be able to handle fulfillment. I mean, we're not looking to do it actually for a little while, um, obviously, because it's not due out until. Um, hold on a second. Because it's not due out until, uh, what do you call it? Um, uh, August and then September for the physical version. Um, but yeah, so let us know we can do that. So what's up, Dragon? Hello, everybody. Yeah, I got that. Well, because I was teaching today, so I had the, I had the look. Yep, I did. I came from a show today. Actually, um, uh, I was actually starting late today because I went to a review. Um, I review shows for Curtain Up, and uh, I haven't done it for probably four months or so um, because I've been because of my health stuff that was going on and I was too busy with a Kickstarter and doing other things and so um, yeah so uh, but I did one tonight um, it was a musical it was um, decent um, it was like an hour-long musical called Arlington 
um, very, very well acted um, about this woman whose husband is off at a war and stuff like that. Very well acted, very well performed. It was basically just her and then this guy who's a piano player um, and also the musical director did musical theater at Harvard. He just graduated from Harvard and now this guy's doing off-Broadway shows. So that is that is living the dream. Um, but it was good. But anyway, so didn't get started until later on. So uh, let's see. Bow down to the vest. What's up? <laughs> What's up, True Gamer? You face! <laughs> It's like it's like you're very like aggressive. You face you, face face. Anyway, what's up, Xanos? What's going on, man? Yeah. So um. Anyway. So that's what's up with me. What's up with all you fine people? What's going on with you folks? How's life, the universe, and everything? Even even. Mm -hmm. Yes. So um. Yeah. What's going on? How's everyone, has life in the universe and uh, the world? Everyone cold? Everyone appropriately cold? Because uh, it's still cold outside. So, um, still winter. And, uh, I like the snow as much as the next guy, but I would like, um, I would like winter to come to an end now. I am ready to move on to spring. That would be nice. So, hey, what's up, Mull? 42. <laughs> what is 42. What's going on, Morgan? Yeah, so I'd like winter to come to an end. I would appreciate that very much. Because um, I am tired of winter, honestly. Um, so, sitting there stroking your beard. So I have this, so you're like this. You're like, I could pop a beer open. Speaking of which, I got to fix the autofocus because apparently webcam doesn't remember that it's supposed to not have autofocus on. Bear with me one moment. Please do not autofocus camera. I have asked you not to do that. Thank you. Oh my god, really, Dragon? Yeah, that's right. Um, thief passed along... I'm Thief, yes. That's exactly right. Dragon Spear passed along a good uh, Thief code to me, which Satobo had mentioned as well from 2Game. And actually, if that's still running, Dragon, maybe you could post that in chat for people if you're interested. Um, but then you also won the uh, raffle for Thief at Dan's Gaming. Nice. Which you immediately gave up because you already owned it, right? Right? You immediately were like, oh, no, I couldn't. I I already own Thief. Right? Sure. You're sick, you need a gaming PC, and some of your teachers at school give me attitude. That's you. Oh, I'm sorry, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hear you, man. I hear you. Life. Keep in the... Hang in there, man. Hang in there. It does... It gets better. It gets better. 42, the answer to the great question of like, Oh, yes, 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 yes. Sorry. Missed the reference initially. Sorry, Xanos. Oh, man. You got a good three to four inches on your beard. I could, you know, I could let this thing grow out. The problem is, um, see, if I just, if I let it grow out uh, too far, then it gets really, un well, first of all, my wife is like, what are you doing? And secondly, um, it gets really uncomfortable. Like, I don't know, I guess maybe people just trim around the lips but, like, to me, if it gets too long, I'm just kind of, like, eating, and then I start getting a mouthful of mustache, and no one wants that. I'm just like, ugh, 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 So, that's the problem. That's why I got to keep it neat and trimmed, you know what I mean? I actually, you know, I actually liked, in some ways, I like the goatee look better. Um, but the problem is that with the goatee look, you got to constantly be shaving it. And I don't, uh, you know, it's a lot easier to just tr to be able to trim once every couple of weeks than having to shave every couple of days. Um, so... Anyway, uh, I do I do not. Um, actually, Xenos, the Shadowrun expansion you have to buy, right? Dragonfall DLC you have to buy, I assume. I saw that it was just made available, um, and I was actually reading. I read a review. Rock, Paper, Shotgun really liked it. So, um, But I suspect the DLC is you have to pay for, which means I probably will get it. You trim the mustache. Yeah, I hear you. Okay. Well, there you go, Memo. There you go. Um, what was I going to say? Thanks, Dragon. So that link that Dragon just put up there is a um, pretty good deal for for Thief, if you guys are interested. So probably what I'll do is I'll probably play Thief, finish it, go back and play Thief, Deadly Shadows, and finish that. And then I'll probably play Dragonfall, because I was planning to play it anyway. And then after Dragonfall, then I'll have to decide if I go back to Blackguards or if I go on to um, uh, my Magic Legacy X, which is a possibility. So that was the $28 Thief link, yeah. So good deal better deal than I got so all right so uh, anyway it's good to see everyone 
see all you lovely people. Uh, we are going to get going with some Thief. Um, I am going to be playing not as long tonight, um, just a couple of hours probably, because um, I normally like to get started on Thursday nights at about 9-ish, um, and tonight I'm getting started at about 11-ish, because as I said, I was at a show, so I'm starting late. But that's okay, because we're going to play tonight, and then obviously tomorrow, Friday, um, we have uh, on uh, Friday, uh, I'm going to be streaming during the day. So you will see me tomorrow during the day as well. So you'll get plenty of me over the next couple of days. So, all right. Um, so let us get ourselves underway. There I am. Down in the corner. That's me in the cut light. Losing my religion. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Xanos, really? Dude, are you sure, man? Don't say, don't waste your money on me. You don't need to do that. Z no, I, it's on, it's on, man. I got it. Uh, Xanos uh, just sent me the Shadowrun Dragonfall. Yeah, all night stream. Yeah, no. Uh, Xanos just sent me the Shadowrun Dragonfall DLC. Thank you, dude. When am I going to play Batman Arkham Asylum? I already played that, Dragon. I already played Arkham Asylum and won it. I played Arkham City and won it. And I played Arkham uh, Origins and won it on stream, all of them. Sorry, man. You need a better PC. Yeah. Well, there's people on here who are pretty good at building PCs for cheap, you know, so. Um, but yeah, Xenos, you sure, man? I mean, I really appreciate it, but you don't need to do that, man. I can, I can afford to buy it. That's not, you know... It's okay. You don't need to. You don't need to give it to me. Oh, nice. All right, dude. Well, thank you very much, Jazanos. Also, just so you know, this is not going to be getting played until after I finish Thief, and um, I have to finish Thief and I have to finish uh, Deadly Shadows. So it's going to be after I play those. But thank you very much, man. I really appreciate that. Thank you, Zanos. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate that. Thank you very much. So much kindness from peoples. I really appreciate that. Thank you, dude. Oh, no, no, I am. I am going to... Oh, no, no, I'll definitely play it on stream. I'm gonna, I told you when I'm going to play it. It's going... It goes Thief, uh, Deadly Shadows, and this. And then Dragonfall. So, in that order. Thief, Deadly Shadows, Dragonfall. Yeah. Yeah, um, Dragon Spear, if you go back, you can take a look at my videos. Um, in my videos, I even have highlights of all of those. Actually, Asylum was the first game that I played on my new PC, my new rig, um, that I got, I guess, a little over a year ago now. Um, and then uh, Arkham City was the first game I played when I got my new video card. Um, the, well, the video card that I had up until I got my GTX 760. Um, so, yeah, and then Origins I actually played, I think, with my GTX 760. So Batman, for some reason, has tracked very closely to all the games that I've played. I don't know why this is, but it's tracked very closely to the upgrades that I made on my computer at various times. So, Thanks, dude. I, well, I really appreciate that, Xanos. Thank you very much, man. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, Th no, I'm not going to play Thief Dark Project. I already won Thief a long time ago. I don't feel like going back and playing that on stream, honestly. Um, I may play Thief 2 co-op with Series Runner. That may happen maybe during the summer or something like that. That'll, that may happen eventually. But the new Thief games, I think once I finish Thief and Thief Deadly Shadows, I'll be kind of thiefed out for a bit. Um, so it'll be a good time to go back to, um, at that point, into uh, Shadowrun Dragonfall. And then maybe after that, head into uh, Might Mag Magic uh, X Legacy. So we'll see. But, um, yeah, Graydon, actually. Yeah, I played Origins. Yep, I played Arkham Origins, too. I played Arkham Origins uh, a few months ago, actually. I liked it, actually. I, I liked all of them. I thought, for me, the order was, um, I still think Arkham City was the best. I think Arkham Asylum was second. I thought Origins was third, but I thought that Origins had the boss fights in Origins. There were sequences in Origins that were the best of any Batman game that I've played. So there were sequences in Origins that were just amazing. There's a 20-minute sequence in the middle um, when you first confront Bane, when you first fight Bane. There's a middle sequence starting with the fight against him and going for like the next 20, 25 minutes, which is jaw-droppingly good. So I thought that Origins got a lot of um, lot of unfair hate. I thought that there were some, some problems with it. It was not a perfect game, but I thought it was very good, and I thought there were a lot of really good moments, and the boss fights were sick. The boss fight against Deathstroke was nuts. Really, really good stuff. So, yeah. Oh, nice. How did you make this money, Xanos? Are you making this money off of uh, 
You making this money off of the Steam trading card type of thing? Let me get playing while we're doing this. Uh, what am I looking at? Show me a thief. Wait a minute. Oh, Wasteland 2 Early Access. I oh, know. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> Why not play some Battlefield Bad Company? Yeah, and I don't think that's really my thing, man. <laughs> You've been prostituting yourself? Impressive. Most impressive. Alrighty. <laughs> Lego. Hooray. Powered by the Unreal Engine, like every game ever. Oh, very nice. Counter Strike, oh yeah, yeah. I just love, I, you know, as I say, I'm, I don't have a lot of patience for the, this is just like Dishonored, because obviously Dishonored was inspired originally by Thief. But some of the, some of the like text, like this reminds me, this opening sequence of a cross between this, between Dishonored, like look at the angle of the lines and everything, and Batman. If you combine Batman, the Batman games, with the Dishonored like font, you'd end up with Thief. Like even, I'm just talking about like the music and stuff, it's pretty funny. Got here. Um, oh, last manual save, last checkpoint. Last manual save, please. <laughs> I know, Lego. It's a good point. It's a good point. I should know by now. Will I play Wolfenstein: New Order? You know, the last Castle Wolfenstein I played was the original. Castle Wolfenstein. Um, I'm not a big shooter guy, honestly, gamer. Um, I don't really like sh uh, shooters for the most part. So... Wait. Somehow it, did, it lost my controller options. Please invert. Wait. What? I said invert the axis. What the heck? Oh. Oh. Because it's not controller, it's... Oh, sigh. There we go. That's more like it. Okay. Alright, let's take a look at what we got. Turn the map. Let's take a look at that journal. Yeah, I agree, Glob. I agree. Yeah, Xanos, I don't think you've seen me play this. I, uh, I'm, I'm pretty impressed so far. Yeah. Uh, okay, what do we got here? Objectives, yes. So I've got a bunch of side quests. So um, I, the main quest here is the Queen of Beggars one. Um, I want to do the side quest first. So I've got um, Writing Wrongs, which is the one I think I'm doing next because I'm closest to it. So for Writing Wrongs, um, I have to get this book. Actually, wait. This is where I have to go talk to a writer and basically uh, take his manuscript so that he doesn't do it. So as an author, I feel like it's my job to steal this man's manuscript because because reasons, I guess. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Exactly. And Thief was in development before Dishonored, so... And obviously, as a game sequence, it's a lot better, so. Alright, so I gotta steal a manual. Sounds like a plan. More guards. Whoopsie. Jeez, they're so quiet now. Who is that? No sign of trouble here. Huh? I think I saw somebody. 
All's well, as far as I can see. Whoops. Oh, I screwed that up. Whoops. I screwed that up. <laughs> that is not... Uh, what I just did there is not right. Yes, yes. Oh, man. Duty! There could be only one writer. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, like, I'm, yeah, I'm not stealing his manuscript. I'm stealing his ideas. That's, that's the way this actually goes down. What's up, Bagel? How you doing, Duty? What's up, Bagel? Yeah, I know. Outlast. Oh, yeah. For those of you who are here watching me play this, when it turned into, like Satobo said, it turned into a Japanese horror film. to see if these guys where they walk in okay let's so walk on by guys something feels wrong haha very nice gods to grave holes okay oh nice uh, I have to remember how to quick save. <laughs> I think it's just F5, but uh, let me check. Hey, Zader, what's up, Zader? Hello, Franzel. I'm sorry, Glob, I have no idea what you just said. <laughs> I'm sure it's just because I'm misunderstanding, but I don't have any idea what you're saying. Uh, let's see, what the heck is quick save? F5. Uh, of course. There we go. Maybe I'll sleep tonight. You can smell the river from here. Oh. I thought it was going to go farther than that. Whoops, it's not what I meant to do. Alright, so I have to go out this way. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, Glob. <laughs> I gotcha. I gotcha. Yeah, I, you know, so far, I'm not agreeing with the, the take. It's seen a lot of people, a lot of the reviewers had on this. Um, it's the most useless place I ever went to in my life. What is the point of this? I was all excited. I'm like, ooh, a pipe. And then it's like, yeah, that gets you this far. That's great. Okay, guys. Um, I'm not buying it. Uh, I think that there's... Um, I mean, I understand why people would say that they I, I don't think the game's perfect I think there's issues but I just don't I don't know where they're coming from as acting like it's this god awful you know embarrassment I, I just don't I just don't agree I just don't think they're I just think they're off That joke, though. Yeah, a lot of people, like, if you go read Kotaku, Xanos, Kotaku actually, I said before that if it turned out, Kotaku went so far down the rabbit hole in terms of what they said was bad about it, that if it didn't turn out to be as bad as they claimed, I was going to be pretty annoyed with Kotaku. So I'm pretty annoyed with Kotaku. It is not nearly as bad as they said. 
they were just like, oh, you know, it's like, it's, a, it's an embarrassment, you know, the, the combat system. I'm like, the combat system, it's Thief. It's Thief. Why are you acting a combat system? You know, it's like, do you, have you ever, do you know anything about Thief? Do you know what it's called? Like, why it matters? This book is going to be my big break. Oh. I can just feel it. But, my dear fellow, who ever did you find to publish such a tawdry romanticization of the life of a common thug? Clock Tower Bookbinders, over at the plaza? They said it was exactly the kind of book that would draw the watcher's attention. Do you think I should have asked for a bigger advance? Undoubtedly. Bigger advance? That's how you know this is a game when the writer's talking about big advances. Not accurate. Yeah, Total Biscuit, and Total Biscuit, from what I understand, liked this game. I haven't seen it yet, but he supposedly liked it. Um, I don't know where this, where the book is or why I don't see it. Maybe there's an upstairs that I'm missing? Hmm. Well, yeah, Bagel, because Dishonored was, was uh, inspired by Thief, this series, so... Where's the book? Oh. There we go. Well, how the hell do I get up there? Maybe I do need to get higher. Higher and higher. <laughs> Fair enough. Are you are you are you suggesting that the ability to write is not impressive anymore, Glob? That's funny, Dragon. Ooh, there's loot down there. I'm gonna have to go get that in a minute. Wait. What? Oh, he they changed it. Search the clock tower book binders for the manuscript. Oh, 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 oh. So he brought it somewhere. I see. Okay. That's not bad. I thought it was just it was going to be one of the things where you just like go to an area and you just get it there, but it turns out you some of these side quests you actually have to do some movement around there, so that's cool. Um. Um, there's only one context uh, contextual bar, Zader, um, and it's been irritating guilt, I know, um, because like the same thing that you use to swoop, which is like this, that's called swooping. You'd use that with spacebar. And that's the same exact thing as, like, um, as using the space bar to, like, run and parkour and to mantle, you know, to, like, jump up on, uh, jump up in areas. So it's, um, so I haven't had any problems with it so far, honestly. Like, it hasn't been an issue for me, but I don't know. Um, again, this game, the, the stealthier you are, the better it is. It completely rewards stealth. Even more than Dishonored did. Like, Dishonored, you could theoretically go in like a badass. Um, this game is not about that. If you try to go in like a badass, you are in trouble. So. IGN Italy gave Thief 80. Well, it's funny, uh, Eurogamer didn't like this, but Eurogamer Italy did like it. I don't know. I guess the Italians are happy lately.
That's a lot better. Since I still don't know. What happened to the sloop sounds? Supposedly the buckbinders are here, but I don't know. I don't know where. I don't understand. Search the clock tower bookbinders for the manuscript. There may be two ways to get in there. I may have to go up top to get in. Which I'm not going to do until these fellows leave. Not enough cardboard boxes to hide in. Yeah, that's true, Glob. That's true. I love Dishonored. I thought Dishonored was a great game. But, uh... But, um... I don't know. Thief is... Thief is good stuff, man. Okay, so there's got to be another way around the outside. Surprised they haven't started pulling the buildings down for firewood. Don't give them any ideas. There we go. Always a back entrance. And it's clever the way they disguise the loading screen. This is a loading screen, but it looks different because the way it's set up. So, all right, let's go get us a manuscript, chat. Aha! First of all, let's get rid of that. Silver bell, silver bell. Weather's turning. Bookbinders register. New document. Yeah, exactly, Durbin. Exactly. That's why I love Thief. I, I have a friend, actually, a good friend of mine, um, loves Thief. And I think when I tell him about this, he's going to be super excited. Because they didn't make Garrett into a badass. Because he, a combat badass. Because he's not a combat badass. You know what Garrett is? Garrett is the guy who sits as a thief when a soldier comes up to him like this. Like a guard comes up to him like that, stares at him, and walks away because he doesn't see him. Because Garrett's in the shadows. That's awesome. And the first time you do it, you feel like an incredible badass, but a thief, not something else. So, all right, Bookbinders Register, 612, The Mechanical Hammer and Other Short Stories, 3rd Edition, Buntel Acquired, 614, The Mummer's Curse, Pots Acquired, uh, 619, Noble's Guide to South Corridor, Slumming, A Holiday from the Pressures of Civility, A Aldale Acquired, This Damn City, Houndsley Purchased, 622, Framed Screams and Running Herd, 1st Edition, Unknown Purchased. Um... I'm looking for a thief manuscript, so I assume it's 622, right? I would guess. <laughs> I know, right, Zenith? The trap door. Ah, trap door. Very nice. In we go. I love the way they did the little secret switches. Yeah. Oh my god. I want to. Oh. I want to study like this. I want to study with a secret trap door that leads to this. Look at this. It's not like Basso to shy away from infamy. He used to wear it like his bad perfume. Laid on thick. Yeah. I want a place like that. Don't you guys... Wouldn't that be awesome? I'm going to go read my book once I go to my secret trap door. Ah, oh, it's so awesome. Love it. Yeah, I agree, Zader. Okay. Um, this Damned City, an original manuscript by G.T. Hounsley. Gentle reader... From your bedchamber, you could only guess at the thievery and general black-handedness that runs rife in the streets like a pack of hungering rats. But now, steal yourself, for your humble author means to guide you into that very darkness. Picture, if you will, a villain in the shadows, a big man, wide of face and jowl and figure, smelling both sweetly and of flophouse sweat, and a muskier scent you might guess to be the mark of some wild bird. Indeed, look! The bird itself comes as if from the maw with a dastardly flapping to alight on his dirtied fingers, stained yellow with pipe smoke. Basso arises. It's terrible writing. The guy doesn't deserve to be published. See you, true gamer. That's true. If I tell everyone, it's not going to be very secret. <laughs> yeah. 
You make a good point. Must be a guard outside, I assume. Ah, uh, I love this. So cool. Of course, I don't know why you have candles underground in a bookstore filled with paper. Like, I don't... That strikes me as a disaster waiting to happen, but... Oh, well. Alright, objective complete. Well done. Alright, what do we got left? We've got the bank. Let's take a look, actually, at the map. Let's see what we got. We have got the medication bottle. We've got Hector in his workshop. Get to the bank. Steal Sick Willie's golden watch. That looks like it's next. Let's take a look at the details. Sick Willie deserves everything that's coming to him. He used to lord it all over Blackfur with his gold pocket watch, but he still cheated his whores out of coin every chance that he got. I reckon his days are numbered, sure enough, what with the gloom and his raging syphilis. And I want that watch before some lucky raker snags it. All right. Hey, Wyval, what's up, man? Doing some accounting. Oh, yeah. All right, let's do it. Let's go get this. Let's go get this watch, shall we? I love that trap door, man. That is that is sweet. Oh, I can't put it back? Oh, should let me put it back. Alright. Oh, you can smell it. Okay. Alright, let's save it. Okay. Oh. Why did I think that was my fault? I thought that was closer. It's actually not that close. Um, but. Hmm. But actually, once I get that done, all my other. Yeah, so I'm going to. I actually am going to do this. It's the farthest away, but then all my rest of the stuff is up here. So I will go take care of that one. Actually, I don't think that guy's a guard, actually, but... Way too much light. Do not like all that light. Oh, what's next? Alright, how are we doing here? Uh, good. Alright, so... I can go down and over, I think. Save it. Baker closed down all of a sudden. His bread was stale, oh. but at least it was bread. That was a... you know? Guards there, it could have been bad. Could have been a problem. Gods to grave holes. Whew. Let's take a look at this map, shall we? Alright, so I want to go right, right, and over.
Oh boy. I hope someone starts some trouble. I'll put them in their place. <laughs> I'll put them in their place. I'm an overly dramatic watchman. with gloomers? Great idea, sloop for brains. Doesn't feel safe on the streets. Man. Freaking guards everywhere, man. In we go. I know, right? It's like the loot glint. This you're like, place oh. brings a new meaning to House of Ill Repute. I just don't think he should be walking around with all those letter openers. I'm telling you, it's like those letter openers and like the scissors cannot be good for him when he's in the rush. Just saying. That. Take that. Okay. Well, you missed it, Xanos. She's already made her appearance several times. <laughs> Whoa, hot tub. not the most impressive brothel I've ever seen. I know. Hey, what's up, Jedi? I know. I just have this image he's going to fall wrong and all of a sudden, pokey pokey, you know? Watch the watch ons. I already saw that one. Hmm. It's not helpful. I know that was pretty funny. Thank you, Demiser. Yeah, that that was really funny. I, if someone was like, uh, if someone was like, Thief Two, daughter of Garrett. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Except she was wearing her unicorn hat. So she was sneaking up on me with her unicorn hat. Ah, yes, Waval. Yes, yes. Still looking for this watch. It's supposedly around here someplace. I thought. Unless they moved it. Did they move it somewhere? Steal sick Willie's golden watch. Okay. I mean, a 
I think I'm, I don't know, Sick Willie's Townhouse. Yeah, I'm in the right spot. Just gotta find where the hell his watch is. Ah, letter to Sick Willie. Willie, you bastard. You knows I done you good and got Doc right off you besides. Pay up or I'll send Jeb Chokes to the Yield Biters on a visit. He don't like people cheating him on his investments. Um, that may mean that it got moved. Pen. So to get moved, is that the idea? No. We got to play against Jeanette Lee. Wow. That's the that's uh the Black Widow, right? Jeanette Lee. So obviously there's a second floor that I missed. I assume. This is a dump. Hmm. window over here. She's Black Widow, yeah. Yeah, I can see some of that Jedi for sure. You'll love this. The Blacktops tried to evict Mortimer. Now there's a job I wouldn't take. Of course, he went off on them, so they beat the tallow out of him. Well, he had it coming. And then they pitched him in a cart. He wasn't even dead. Ha! Secret? Ooh, ooh. this area's just got a secret. I remember seeing her on ESPN2 a couple times playing the pool tournaments. That's like, really? All that for this? That's dubious. Dooby, dooby, dubious. Alright, so I gotta get up there somehow. The hell? Oh my god, what did I just... Oh, oh my god, look at that. It's, cro it's like a... It's a crossbow trap. Whoa. I think I've already been in this one. I think I've already been in this one. Damn it. Ow, 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 ow. T 
it's, it's a miser. She has a pool book, really? Wow, there's some wrenches. Something feels wrong. Oh man. What's up, Thor? That's where I'm trying to gotta get over up there and over somehow. <laughs> Tavern's shutting up. Where will I drink? Ah, yeah, pretty much that wasn't gonna work. I knew that wasn't gonna work. One by one. Last is the king's blood, and then the one. Oh, how I tell you what. <laughs> I don't know. I, I I may have missed something when I went in here the first time. I don't understand. I may have missed something here. Yeah, you take fall damage. Rage quit. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. You take fall damage and you do it as stupidly as I just did it there. It's got, his watch has got to be around here somewhere. Watch it be back there. Hey, Pav. I haven't checked the paintings yet, no. Ah, thank you. It's just, it's just low-hanging fruit. Uh, there's, there's no other way to put it. It's just, it's just low-hanging fruit. Thank you for the, uh, thank you for the suggestion. It's just the first thing you go to the painting. He's like, bam! Like, oh man, really? Wah! You like sick Willie. Oh. Survived only by his sense of humor. Okay. Um <clears throat> that that scared me a little bit, I won't lie. The eel biters. 
Willie's business affairs were as bad as his health. That kind of scared me a little bit. But I'll take the Riverside tip. What's up, Stolpen? <laughs> I know, right, Thork? I was like, ah! <laughs> Goddamn jump scares. All right. In four, out 29. Four less 29. Negative 25. Last of Eelbiter's low number three gone. Girls want their cut or they're out. No girls equals no scratch. No scratch equals no paying back the Eelbiter's. Freaking bells. What's the lock on the safe? Set to current year, I think. What year is it? Think the eels are following me. Do they know about me? Riverside Hole. One of the girls tell them. Collected of everything I could pawn off. Won't flip my freaking watch, though. Man needs his watch. Feel like I thistled my breeches today. Watch. A nice piece. It should find a good price if no one knows where it's been. Oh yeah. Uh, sick Witty was sick Willie was hiding out and uh didn't work out for him in the end. God, that was a little scary. <laughs> I was kinda like, uh Alright. That leaves us with three of these. See what we got. Oh, I gotta get out first before I can see any of these things. <laughs> see you, see you, dragon. Have a good night, man. Okay, now we can look at the map. All right, so. Now we've got whoops whoops so I've got machinations medical misery and get to the bank so let's do those in order let's go with machinations first meet Hector in his workshop I got a new job for you from a faded old hobnob up in stone market one of the barons engineers has taken a shine to independence Hector's his name he's an odd one all right but the pay's good and sticking it to the baron can make any medicine go down just fine Okay. Let's do it up then. Can we go back to the painting now? What apple? Good God, man. What obelisk plate? Um, pal, what are you talking about? Or pay well, it's I believe he said it was Pavu, right? If not mistaken. Where is this obelisk plate you're talking about? middle of what the building <laughs> I have a trick to make dried meat go down easier close your eyes and remember real meat you mean close your eyes, hold your breath, and don't chew. Well, I gotta get back up there to do that, so hold on a second. Alright, here we go. Now, what are you talking about? Okay. Alright, so here I am back again.
Check to see if the guards are going to come this way. Okay, so what are you talking about now? You missed it again? What? All I need is one good opportunity. Worn out. I'm looking exactly. Yeah, I can't unscrew that. Yeah, with this chat delay, I'm never going to be able to figure it out this way. What do you mean? This thing here? Those are those are wood. <laughs> yeah, very cute, you know, I'm very cute. Um So I'm staring at this. What do you mean, Pav? I'm staring. I'm not going to move till you tell me. I'm going to quick save it in the meantime. Good to see you in. What's up, man? Um so That stuff right there is not is. I can't st I can't sign in right at the moment, Memo. I'm sorry. Give me give me a second, okay? Bit to my right. What? in the middle of the boxes. Oh! Okay, hold on. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. Let me, let me wait till the guards go. You mean on the other side of the obelisk. Got it. Thank you. Considering pulling an all-nighter to fix your sleep schedule? <laughs> yeah, I hear that, man. Yeah, I got you, Pat. I see, I see. I see, Pat. What's up? I got you. I see it. My back's hurting bad. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Good find. It didn't seem to do anything. Okay, that's cool. City Heritage Plaques. Ulysses Northcrest Obelisk. Northcrest I cast aside the yokes of the old gods. Hmm. Interesting. Alright. Okay, thanks. Thank you, sir. Good call. All right. What's up, Grand? Okay. Okay, now we can do what I was planning to do before. Uh, where am I? Here. So I got to get to here. So I got to go. <laughs> I got to go long ways. Baker closed down all of a sudden. His bread was stale, but at least it was bread. Oh, didn't you know? He was hanged for graven crimes or some such. You ask me, he was behind on paying his special taxes. I should get more sleep. I was just doing this because this is the quickest way from point A to point B, but... wasn't very exciting. Oh my god, Miser. Nope. No. Safe on the streets. 
Okay. Make sure I'm going the right way. Yes, I am. Yes, I am going the right way. Swoop. Swoop. There it is. Swoop. There it is. You can smell the river from here. All right, see you, miser. <laughs> cute. That was cute. Completely hit the wrong button. Yeah, I know. I'll be glad when this is all over. Yeah, that's basically what I'm trying to do, Pev. I'm freezing. It's not at all what I wanted to do. So much light. There was a sloop stall nearby. Okay, good. Should still be on target. Yep. We gotta go around. Uh, it's left. cold out tonight. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Also, uh, sorry, Memo. You said you wanted me to log into Steam quickly. What's up with Steam? Oh, cool. Oh, thank you, Memo. Memo gave me the Witcher Enhanced Edition Director's Cut. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, Memo. I'll throw that in my gift inventory, and I will either give it away or use it. Thanks, Memo. I appreciate it, man. Thank you, sir. Thank you for being you. Thanks very much, man. You guys are awesome. I've always said. Best viewers on Twitch. Thanks very much, Memo. I appreciate that, man. Not feeling all that well. Okay, should be almost there. Good. All right, Hector. What's going on? Yes, I would like to enter Hector's Emporium. Ooh, okay. There's more? Uh... Let me see. Oh! Yes, there is. Oh, The Witcher 2! Thank you. And Nazi Zombie Army 2. <laughs> Sniper Elite. Thanks, man. Thank you so much, Memo. I appreciate that, man. Thanks, dude. That's very nice of you. Thanks a lot, Memo. I appreciate that, man. Thanks. Alright, you may return to Memo's regularly scheduled contest. Thanks, dude. I appreciate it. All right, Hector. What's up? Hector, I presume. Is that you? The master thief? Who's your friend? That's my metal man right there. My life's work. All clockwork and machinery. He could revolutionize the city. Get me the recognition I deserve. If it weren't for that damned Baron. The Baron's a damn fool. He grew impatient. Ordered me to destroy the project. 
I couldn't pull apart my metal man, could I? No. Good job, Hector. What do you need? My friend here is almost whole. Problem is, I've been stabbed in the back by the very scum I hired to build him. One jealous lout even stole my metal man's mechanical hand. And you want it back. Exactly. Alfonso, the weaselly tailor of Stone Market, has stashed the hand in his shop. Recover the device, and I'll pay you for your trouble. Hmm. Hector wants me to break into Alfonso's tailors and steal a mechanical hand he says belongs to him. Something feels odd about this don't whole affair, me, don't you Please. think? My groveling days are behind me. Oh, the loot sounds interesting. All right. Finally, someone who recognizes the importance of my work. Check out Alfonso's attire in Stone Market. That weasel's no doubt stashed my metal hand in his tailor shop. Good job. Alfonso's attire. All right. We're going to do that. Just as soon as we steal everything else in the place. They think I can't pull it off. Hector's Memoirs. Page 1218. I finally completed my automaton after months of solitary hardship. Upon seeing the glory of my invention, Baron Northcrest begged my forgiveness, but I told him it was too late. The city had proved itself unworthy. My automaton's magnificence could not be appreciated in his kingdom of squalor. Thusly, I bestowed my automaton on the great city of Blackbrook. My invention revolutionized industries and brought prosperity to their people. Blackbrook held a parade in my name. As I looked past the faces of the adoring crowd, my eyes lighted on the distant shape of the city, a tiny, dying husk that would soon only be remembered as the birthplace of Hector Rothschild, engineer, inventor, genius. End of Volume 1. A profane sketch of Alfonso clockwise in Baron Northcrest fills the margin of the final page. <laughs> He's a loony. Show them. Show all of them. Letter to Clockwise. Stop ignoring... Oh, all caps. Stop ignoring my letters! I know you've locked up in your house. I know you have the Metal Man's heart. I know the engineer's been feeding you lies. You're better than this, Clockwise. We can still build the Metal Man together. Reply soon or I'll be forced to take the heart by force. That's a promise, Hector. Is anyone getting a really, really, really sketchy vibe from all this? Mr. Rothschild, you're treading on thin ice, Hector. I won't assist your new endeavor. The heart is the product of my innovation. If anything, I should inform the engineer of your dreadful plot to commandeer the automaton project. If I hear any further discussion of this, I swear I'll take every action to stop you from the death of Luther Clockwise. Nice. Congratulations, man. Yeah, if I'm going to work for this dude, I want to know all the details. <laughs> I'll show them. Show all of them. Hmm. I suppose breaking it right next to him is not likely to work. What's up, 1298? Getting sneaky with it. Na 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 na. I'll get you out of here soon enough. We're going places, you and I. I'm a busy man, but I'll make time for you. Check out Alfonso's attire in Stone Market. That weasel's no doubt stashed my metal hand in his tailor shop. Just put a bucket on his head. You brought the claw back to where I wanted it. Thank you. Yeah. All right. All right, so I have to go to Alfonso's Tire. To do that, I need to go outside so I can see that map. Something. I'll play along, at least until I've been paid. Okay. I wonder where he spends the money that he gets. Just curious, you know? So I gotta go pretty much straight across the way. I should get more sleep. 
Wait a minute. I'm starving. Uh. You think the Baron's future is still coming? <coughs> I don't think any future is coming. Should have left years ago. What? <laughs> He's a hoarder or a hoarder hookers, yeah. One or the other. Okay, well, how the hell do I. Oh, God. Could have been a real problem. Them guards. Them guards, them guards, them silly guards. Back's hurting bad. Wait till he turns around and goes back the other way. Thanks for doing that memo. Uh, I need to rest. All right, so I have to get up there. Is there a what I give? Oh, coffee. Yes, there is a rope arrow. It's the rope that I put up there to begin with. That's cool that the rope stays. That's cool. Okay. All right, I should be able to get up and over this way. I'll wait till the guards go past that. Well, actually, no. I'll wait till they go back under. We need to go over there, actually. Okay, well, I got this loot anyway. But I may need to go over there, I think. I have to go maybe across those awnings, then get onto there, and then that should hopefully get me up to there. I see. Yeah, I know, right? Only be lit by the computer monitor? I thought about that. What did that sound of it? This is the Baron's watch. Someone there? Was nothing. Nothing here. Nothing to do but watch the hangings. Too much noise. <sighs> I always misinter- I always forget about, um, that rope. Ah, gosh darn it. These guards are not- they're too far- the guards are too close. I screwed that up. Why don't they go farther away? I don't understand that route. Why would they just like walk back and forth in like this this like fifty foot area? Alright. 
Okay, that's safer. Show if I'm not careful. Right, this brings me back there, which I don't want to go to yet. So I need to be able to get. Right, down and over. Alright. Alright, I know where I am. Yeah. Hungry. No bleeder. But it's not safe here anymore. <laughs> Shoot. I'm not understanding how to get to this place. I feel like I'm missing something obvious. I'm freezing. Yo, don't, don't tell me, Pop. I'll figure it out. Don't tell me. Hey, what's up, Wasabi? How you doing, man? Oh, thanks, dude. Good to see you, man. I'm getting sick. I know it. Hey. <laughs> I'm like pickpocketing it from in front of him. I'm like, huh, I'm like, what are you doing? I'm like, nothing. Turn away. It's cold out tonight. There we go. Maybe I have to go around and over. It could be. I just can't. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's right. That's right, Wasabi. <laughs> is that famous bread belt buckle? Oh my god, what is this? Oh, medical misery is right there. Alright, since I'm here, I might as well do the medical mystery one. You really think this doctor's brewing something better than the other shit soft remedies people are selling? There's a Troy Tani for this. every ailment Would that you they buy don't cheat. A man who's gone and caught Little wonder he can himself. afford guards. But Marco said, "Let me tell you what Marco said." Blah blah blah. I pretend I know things, and only idiots believe me. He does kind of sound like that, doesn't he? Right. The amount of bile has to be proportional to the amount of saliva, otherwise, poof. Not good. Not good at all. Wait. Good doctor. No, that's not right. Let's figure it. Let's uh, see if I can remember exactly what this is about. I'm doing this first. Steal the medication bottle. Dr. Troy claims to have brutal remedies, keeping it locked up in a shop. Get your hands in a sample. You could find ourselves rolling in coin, all in the valiant name of curing the sick. Okay. Have to stay awake. Stay sane. I have to work. Please, please work. The amount of bile has to be proportional to the amount of saliva, otherwise, poof. Not good. Not good. Ah! Wait. No, that's not right. I have to hurry. I have to stay. 
stay awake. Stay sane. Please, please work. Come with me, Doctor. Try a so-called remedy. I don't put much faith in bottled miracles. All right. Easy peasy. Hello there. I know, because I keep thinking there. Because the reason is, uh, Xenos, one of the missions there's actually a um, there's actually a combination inside the closet, and so for one of the missions, like I actually had to go in there and then look to the right to find the uh, closet name or to find the cl the uh, combination. So since then, I've been like, ah, you know. No, oh, nice memo. Yeah, Bed Bath and Beyond has all this weird. Bed Bath and Beyond has become a lot about the Beyond. It seems to me there's a lot of like strange stuff now. Who opened that? Oh hi. Take a look. That's the catch. Not. <laughs> uh, that's why I should actually be looking through the locks. I'm just like, Whoa. Oh, you're not liking the Dragonlance, huh? Really? Hi. Why did that open? Scuttling about. <laughs> swoop. You there. Swoop. Swoop. <laughs> oh, good times. So why are the guards locked in a room? I don't get it. Why why would they be like Why would you have guards here? I just don't understand why you would have the guards there. I do not understand. What's up, build? Burner loves Dragonlance. Or he did. Um, I don't know, Build. I, I had been thinking about doing it for a while. Um, people seem to like the webcam, and I had gotten a new one to do for uh, interviews that I do. And um, so uh, I got my promotion, and I basically was like, you know, I think it's okay if my face is visible. That's all. Yeah, he has guards, like, in the most... There's, like, it's the most useless... I really could not think of a more useless place to put guards. It's really crazy. Alright, all that leaves is Alfonso's attire and the bank.
Dragons of Autumn Twilight. I think I have like nine of the Dragonlance books, I want to say. Alright. Whoops, wait a second. Still have to track this other objective. See what? Rock's teeth. I don't understand. I don't know how I get to this alleged corridor. think there might be a carter through there I just I don't understand what I'm looking at <laughs> wasabi very nice it's getting late some of the later dragon Lance books were not as successful in fairness and I mean, you know, as as a group, the Dragonlance books Same are they're a little young, you know. Ooh, I wonder if that I could swear that looked like somebody. Very friggin' bells. I don't like this. Maybe there's a way to get down there that way. Go like this. And then... This is how I came the first time. Up and around and over. Oh, okay, okay. It's one of the aforementioned loading areas. I'm starving. A real man provides for his family. A real man wouldn't let us starve. Oh? And what would you have me do? Baron's watch is hiring. They must pay better than begging on the street. That's great. Just great. All I have to give up is my common decency. Okay. Could be worse. But I don't really know how. Okay. There we go. Here we go. Hand tailored. Yeah, there are a lot of loading screens in Thief. All right, time to get back a mechanical hand, chat. Still the automatons mechanical. Shut off, Ragbag! This is a private party. If you're still here in three seconds, you're spending the night with the eels. One, two. I'm moving, sir. I'm moving. I'll be glad when this is all over. Okay, got to deal with that guy. I love the wind effects. What happened to the 
sloop sellers. It's all friggin' rats and no show. Get your body out of the light. Seems like a good spot. Okay. This side there is where I need to go. The eel biters for clothing, not putrid rags. What are those stains, anyway? Even the tailors found a way to milk the gloom for a profit. The fabric's rancid. I won't give you a single coin. Fine. We'll toss your place for valuables. Wait, instead. wait, wait. Let's not be hasty. Give me a moment and I'll arrange your payment. Get on with it. Hmm. So that test, so they got the mechanical hand somewhere in there. But I think this is not the right way to go yet. Picking the lock of the front door seems like a good way to get... To get, uh, get killed. So we're gonna do this the old-fashioned way. Hey, what's up, Nisk? No, not so far, Nisk, I haven't. Still pretty early, though. I assume there's plenty of time for that. Mm hmm. So hungry. This damned city. Oh, my God. Guards everywhere. What's that? Oh, that's a poppy, yeah, which I don't use because I don't use focus, but. Wonder what they put in the sloop. Easy. I'm freezing. God damn it. It was the opening and closing the door that did it. <sighs> That's interesting. Can I get to the top floor over there? Or is this just like an extra area? It's not useful. Hey Zach, what's up man?
What do we do for sport with no black tops? Ah. I think I see it. <laughs> Something feels wrong. Mm -hmm. Inventory full. Wow, what is that? Throwable of some kind. Let's turn off that light, first of all. Somebody. Oh, I need to rest. Sounds like there's somebody right in the room next door. Okay, let's take a look at this contract he's got with him. You've got a deal, Alfonso. My eel biters will deliver your fabric twice a week, maybe more depending on what we get from our contacts inside the watch. Pleasure doing business with you, T. So I wonder what it is that he's getting from there. <laughs> that sounds a little dangerous, Zack, and just oh god. Where's he stashing his coin? Wow. Who'd keep friggin' fake gold teeth in a jar? What happened to the sloop sellers? Holy crap, was that close? That was really close. So tired these days. I thought I was going to get taken right then and there. Same night every night. Bastard. Or scare me like that again. <laughs> that guy was up here freaking checking out the case in the joint just like I was. Like, I mean, even these hand mirrors, how does... This guy, like, runs around the city. How is it he runs around the city with these hand mirrors and he doesn't break them? I don't... I understand being light in your feet and all, but... Still looking for this mechanical hand. Ooh. I'll take the statuesque lady. To keep one's figure trim and healthy, fasting and tight corsetry are a must. <laughs> nice. This. In case anyone comes to investigate that, because I want to take a look at this letter. Okay, first of all, got a poppy. Okay, that's nice. And then, documents.
Okay. Uh, engineer's letter to Alfonso. Alfonso, forgive my sudden disappearance. I was forced to enter hiding after my disagreement with the Baron. It's still too dangerous to contact you in person. Please keep the hands safe for now. I will be in touch with further details as soon as I'm able. Sincerely, the engineer. Okay. Well, that gives me some information. Let's save it. Regular save. Okay. I think I've already explored this room, but... Yeah. Yes, I already dealt with that room. Okay. Is anyone... Still checking him out down there. I hope he has it down in the basement. What's that rag stitcher working on down here? Oh boy. <laughs> Have a seat. And if you would come with me, please. thing I need that mechanical hand again more scissors There's so many scissors turquoise brooch show me mechanical hand no what do we have here workbook fabric tensile strength resistance tool mechanical hand ah he's using the mechanical hand to res to uh, help him with his fabric Test one, mild strain, catastrophic grips failure. Test two, mild strain, fabric intact, but the elasticity compromise, success modest. Test three, moderate strain, light grips failure, modest. Progress, fabric quality is improving, must find new supplier before moving forward. I see. And that's safe. Okay. Here we go. Glad that we're picking a lock, because I don't know about a combination. Whoops. And a mechanical hand. Sorry, Afonso. This hand has modeled its last glove. Now I have to escape Alfonso's attire, huh? An intricately designed replica of the human hand. Alright. Found what I need. Now I need to get out. Take a throwable with me. You to breaking stuff, me. Please. Oh, I'll God. Give you anything. Stop your blubbering. <laughs> Where'd you hide your safe key, Alfonso? Get up, Alfonso. Damn shit, Sop can't take a beating. Ah, it hurts. Must be around here somewhere. <laughs> ah, damn it. 
All right. So I have to wait till he finishes his beating and then take that guy down. <laughs> Anyone comes knocking, make a rat show him up. I'm sorry. This will teach you to freaking stuff me. Oh, it's Please. a different guy. I I'll give you anything. What? Stop your blubbering. It's a different guy. <laughs> Where'd you hide your safe key, Alfonso? Get up, Alfonso. Damn shit, Sop can't take a beating. What do we do for sport with no black tops? Hmm. All right, let me let me save that quickly. Not under a quick save. Not a hundred percent sure about this setup yet. So we will have to find out what's going on. Oh, series raid. What's up, Splatter? Hey, big boy. Series raid. Hey, what's up, Kamazoots? Hey, Series. What's up, man? Flamara, what's going on? Hello, hello. 